Hi everyone, welcome back to our, one of my, our another math lessons. Uh, today our uh, title is Common Fraction. common fraction we know uh, about the whole numbers that what is a whole number for example uh, 2 2 is a whole number 3 is a whole number 1 is a whole number any number of numbers are whole numbers 5 is a whole number etc and one is a unit number. One is a unit number. Means that one is a one number. Now to show to show. small to show a small components to show a small components to show a small components of the unit the unit we use we use the fraction to show small components of the unit we use the fraction what we do we divide we divide a unit into components components and we get we get the amount we get the amount the amount that we want For example, uh, like we have a sh uh, sheet of paper, this is a sheet of paper, what we do, we divide this sheet of paper in four small components, four small components. Now, from these four small components, 
we want just one of this, like this one. What we see? See, 1 over 4. For this unit, okay, 1 over 4. This small component is a fraction of unit. The unit is one sheet of uh, paper, but this is 1 over 4. 1 over 4 means that we divide this one into four parts or four components and we require or we want one of this. So we write 1 over. And how much is remaining? The remaining part is 3 over 4. It means from four parts, we want one part, and from fourth part, uh, remaining three parts. The other example, for example, we have two complete sheets of paper, one page, one sheet, two sheet. And what we do? We divide the the third the sheet into three point part, and now from these three part, require all of this completely this one sheet, completely this sheet, and from this one we need this amount of it. What we write? This is a mix mix number mix. Uh, Mix of whole, this is a whole number, this is a whole number, this is a fraction. We write for this one two, two whole number, and two over three. Two over three. It means that uh, two whole sheet, and from the other sheet, we divide it into three parts or three components, we take two of this. We have for one fraction like one, two over three. This two or the upper part of the fraction is numerator. Numerator. The bottom or the down part of this is Dino, Dino, Minator. And this part is whole number, whole number or perfect number. Whole number. Whole number. Numerator, denominator, and this is whole number. Now, what is the proper fraction? Proper fraction or pure fraction? is that is this what is this this is less than your unit less than what than unit unit means one less than 
one or less than unit. So for this kind of uh, fraction, numerator, numerator is smaller than smaller than denominator denominator for example 1 over 4 1 over 4 is a proper fraction because the and then numerator is 1 and we divide this unit into uh, 4 point, parts or 4 portions or 4 components and we take 1 out of the 4 The other one is improper, proper, or mixed fraction. This mixed fraction and fraction is that uh, we have a fraction, and also inside the fraction, the other thing. Uh, whole number 2. So in this uh, case uh, numerator 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 is greater or larger than denominator for example 27 over 4. 27 over 4 means 27 divided by 4. We can write divide in three kinds of things, like 27 over 4, or that's equal to 27 divided by 4, or this is equal to like this, 27 divide by 4. If the numerator is larger or greater or bigger than denominator, we know that there is a whole number also into this one. What we do for this, we divide the numerator to the denominator, 27 divided by 4, 6 times 4, 24, remaining 27 minus 4, 3. It means that 6, the quotient, 6 all, remainder over the divisor. 6, 3 over 4. If I can want to Take this same one, what we do? We multiply this one with this one, multiply, and then the, we do hat the result. 6 times 
24, 24, 27 over 3, 23, 24 over 3 uh, plus 3 is 27 over what? Over 4. 6 times uh, 4 is 24, 24 plus 3 is 27 over 4. You see that this is a mixed mixed problem because mixed means one whole and one uh, fraction. We have a 3, 1 over 4, double fraction. We change this to a change to a fraction. with only for example change this one with only numerator and denominator What we do, what we do, we do whole number, this is whole number, whole number, times denominator times denominator then what we do we had the result with the numerator We had the result of the denominator, and what is the denominator for the new one? The denominator is the old denominator. Old denominator. Here, three times five, the result of this plus one, and the denominator is five. Three times five is fifteen. Fifteen plus one as 16 over 5 But if you change this, uh, the other uh, 
this one like two seven over nine to a fraction with the uh, numerator and denominator what we do we multiply this one with this one and then what we do we add the result with this one 2 times 9 plus 7 over same denominator 9 2 times 9 is 18 18 plus 18 plus 7 over 9 18 plus 7 is 25 25 over 9 if we bring it back to the this uh, position what we do we divide 25 to what 9 by 9 then 2, nine, 2 times 9 is 18, 15 minus 8 is 7, now this is 2 whole number, 7 over 9, remainder over this one. One here, this one here, and this one here. I think this is enough for today. Thank you for watching our videos and thank you for uh, your support and uh, your nice comments and subscribes so don't forget to like subscribe and s share the videos and press the notification bell to get notified for more videos have a good day bye bye